Amidst this worldwide pandemic, safety equipment must be worn. And the shortage of face masks, whether surgical or N95, has forced many to make their own. And some people don't have sewing machines. And the N95 is composed of four layers. One simple solution is your bra. This is a simple way and efficient to make a mask. You can get your basic brassiere. We're gonna give it two minutes on this. So on this one, I'm gonna cut it right here. Then because the bra already has everything in it that you need, except for the scissors and safety pins. So, going to take this off, and then you're going to cut this part of the bra. Now, obviously, a bra that is full lace will not work because you don't want it to be porous. If the bra is lace or Anything else that's see-through, it's not going to keep a microbe out. As you know, each bra has straps. Let's go ahead and get rid of the tag. It's not needed. And you're going to cut it right down the middle of where the hook is. And right down the middle. This is the eye. This one's the hook. Okay, so now we're going to cut it down the middle. Same thing with the other side, right down the middle. Now, what if your bra had three? Just try to get, you're only going to get two out of it because, you know, there's only two cups to a bra. So if it's four or anything more than two, then just split the difference. Okay. One side for each. Now, of course, most bras do have adjustable strap. Oh dear. So if you don't have a sewing machine or a stapler, if you had a stapler, you could staple this together. We're just gonna go on the inside like this. And I'm going to use pins. I'm going to go ahead and put the pins on the inside for now. It may prove to be better if it's on the outside, but I'm just thinking right now to minimize any exposure of something else that could be exposed to the virus or any other microbe that you're looking to avoid. This is going to serve as the head strap, okay? Then I'll take one from this side and I'm going to pin it. And I'm going to take one from the other side and pin it. Actually, I could use the same pin. So that's the savings. As you see, I'm pinning here. And here again, remember, these are dire times. We're in dire straits here. and it's an emergency and an urgency and you don't know when you're going to get your supplies in the mail or when the government's going to get you your supplies this is not something that we would do regularly or i would recommend to do unless it were this kind of emergency such as the days what we're in now which is literally a pandemic it has to be pinned up really well otherwise Sometimes these bras have underwires. That's actually to your good if there's an underwire. I'm going to go ahead and use two pins so that I won't have a wardrobe malfunction. Now, that did actually bring me to somewhat of a pause because as you see, this little thin netting between here may not be able to grip the um, pin very well. So I'm going to have to really secure it a little better and drive this through not that easy. So now I'm going to drive it through this end. 
And remember, bras are products that could be washed and sanitized very easily as opposed to a paper mask that may not actually withstand um, sterilization or laundering. Now for the purpose of this video, if this does come apart, you're gonna have to secure it. You may have to staple it on. But the point of the matter is, now you have created a mask. You have your underwire here is gonna conform to your face. You would, depending <clears throat> on where you have it adjusted, you may have to adjust the straps, obviously, as you see, to fit your head. You may have a, another head uh, gear on, like um, a hat on or something else, because the point is, is that you want to cover up all your body surfaces and you would probably also have goggles on. So I'm going to take it over my head like this. And here again, you're going to adjust it. I'm not going to pay attention to my hair because my hair is a mess. It's okay. I'm just trying to show you what to do. And because it has an underwire, I'm able to do that. And then because of the straps, you're able to adjust the straps. Now, it's important that this is conformed down more. And it won't make... It won't help you if your nose, if you wear it like this, because now your nose is breathing in the virus. You want to cover your face and mouth, and you're gonna have to play with it a little bit to adjust it to your face. As you know, you have the hook and eye, and my hair is getting caught in it, so I'm not going to really actually do this. I'm going to tie it for the moment. And now you have your mask. And this was quick and easy and it is effective while you're waiting for your N95 to come in or any other mask and this can be longer. Thank you very much and be safe. And now a word from my sponsor. Because desperate times calls for desperate actions.